afternoon. Welcome back to Live at 5 at 4. This weekend, the Dragonfly Aerial and Circus Art Studio will host its 8th annual Circus Extravaganza. It'll be at the Clayton Center for the Arts at Pellissippi State, and the first show starts tonight at 7.30. That's, that's coming up. It's close. It is a sight to see. Let me just tell you that. We've got Caitlin Gagné, and we've got... Ka I guess said that right. Yes, and yes. Evelyn Barnett here, and they're dressed as monkeys. Why are you dressed as monkeys? Well, um, we're monkeys in the show. <laughs> That's basically it. Um, our show includes a lot of um, people dressed up as animals and animal puppets. It's going to be a lot of fun. So people who don't know what aerial arts is, Evelyn, what is it? Um, it is a way to express yourself through dance. Um, while using aerial fabrics, trapeze, or a lira, um, we have some new aerial um, apparatuses. apparatuses. <laughs> <laughs> this year in the circus, so we actually have rope and harness and bungee mm -hmm. this mm -hmm. year. Yeah. Um, do you guys do this, what we're seeing on the screen? That I don't know what that's called, but where one person board. jumps on the other uh, side. Oh, yeah. oh, oh! You guys are more graceful than that. <laughs> yeah. That is. We, are, we actually have some kids doing teeter board, and okay. our, as part of our kids' performance group in this year's circus. Okay, but you guys do this. What we're seeing here. What is that called? Where you go up in the fabric? I don't know what it's called. We just. That's what. That's what it's called. We call it aerial fabric. Oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah. Great job. Did so circus last year? It's so neat to look at it, to be there in person, but what does it feel like from your end when you're up in the air and you're spinning around? Oh, it's so much fun. Yeah. It's, um, I don't know, it's just amazing to be able to entertain people like yeah, that. Yeah, the and reaction then, must be cool. Yeah, and then also, too, to learn how to do something that you previously thought was impossible mm -hmm. um, is such a great feeling. Wow, I love watching it. Do you, how, how old or young, what are the restrictions on becoming an aerial artist? Well, um, we teach classes to kids as young as six. Wow. Um, and then there's no age limit as far as taking classes. Um, we've got people basically from six to 60. So There you go. Not only yeah. do you guys perform, but you kind of train and coach other people as yeah. well. Uh, was it like that from the start, or did you guys start as this is something that you love to do, and now you wanted to share your knowledge with them? Um, teaching has always been an important part of Dragonfly. Mm -hmm. Our motto is circus for everybody. So we want to make sure that we can teach people from all walks of life. Um, that's also a good part of the reason why we're putting on this show mm -hmm. is to raise money for our kids scholarship fund so we can um, offer scholarships to kids who may not be able to afford circus classes. What can people expect during this show coming up? They can expect a lot of amazing aerial acts, as okay. well as some comedy routines, and um, to maybe leave with something to think about. Um, mm -hmm. It's going to be so much fun. Well, speaking of the show, your first one's at 7.30, so yeah. you need to scoot on out of here. But um, Evelyn and Caitlin, yeah, I appreciate you guys coming in. And there on the screen is a list of the other shows. So it's tonight and tomorrow at 7.30, and then there's a matinee Saturday and Sunday at 2 o'clock. Head out to Pellissippi State and support a great cause, scholarships for those kids who want to learn how to do aerial arts. Yeah.